I think it's about the same shit like with my fishing license, so I better start to video record this too here. This is kind of hilarious. Uh, I entered here the engine, uh, a Google search, uh, Gaza, Israel, like this. And that's all I get here, basically. I don't get devastation in Gaza, Israel, wages war on Hamas. Yeah, I would expect this. Yeah, okay. I get something, and then let's see here. That's two hours, 12 hours, one day, 15 hours ago. Uh, actually, folks, uh, it's more than devastation. They say it's a massacre. It's another war crime. It's a war crime after war crime. I don't know how many people were actually killed, and I don't see anything. It's interesting because if you go to the Yahoo, let's say, you get nothing other than what you see here. They don't mention this is a British one. This is a British, British United Kingdom. Britannia, rule Britannia. There you go. I'm sure you understand why I'm getting more and more excited about this culture increasingly. And probably why you should too. It's like there's no war in Gaza or anything like this, or you. Well, Ukraine? Where is Ukraine? Eh, you know what? Fuck Ukraine. And Gaza. <laughs> oh, shit. There is something about Gaza right there, okay? Nice. Hamas says it does not have 40 Israeli hostages needed for ceasefire. Hmm? That's all? All right, so basically, this is what we get. Is it Yahoo? Really? I don't think it's date and time here. I think it's it's a game algorithm. I think it's, again, artificial intelligence. And I think if you don't specifically look to it, you're not going to find the information. Once you're going to look to it, uh, the Google, the artificial intelligence is going to start to link your computer with the search engine, at least for today. I think they got it figured out really, really good. Let's go back. I'm gonna do this one more time, like this. And then what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna restrict this to last 24 hours, like this. See, I should have done this already earlier. And, but, it didn't come to me on time. I did not even understood until I was doing today the video about the fishing license. Still, I don't see anything, the news about the news I'm looking for. This is all there is to it. I mean, it's really, really bad, but is that it? I have to be more specific. Oh, look at that. They say Israel war in Gaza, Israeli attack killed 122 in one day. Oh, okay. You know when you kill... I didn't, I didn't click on it. You know when you, when you, 14 is a lot. 14 is a lot. But you have to agree with me that 122 is even more a lot. Yes? Thirty-three thousand four hundred and eighty-two Palestinians have been killed. Seventy-six thousand wounded. Mm, there is... Um, Strange, because there is only one news article that's devoted to to the killing of 122 people? Shit. And that's from Al Jazeera. Shit, I don't see anything from journalists. 
Committee to Protect Journalists, okay, that's interesting. We have a YouTube, that's when the Sky News is right at the top. And uh, you have Al Jazeera in English, we talk about 14, all right? They made it somehow to the top. France 24, ABC, BBC, France 24. Uh, I don't know what that is, the new Arab. Is it American news agency? CBS News, Guardian, CBC, CNN, PBS, none of the networks would report anything about, you see, a boat was 122 people murdered. NPR, Al Monitor, Chinese report 14 dead. And, uh, that's it. I don't see anything. Oh, Al Jazeera again, 122. Okay. Oh, that's that's uh, that's actually really really worrisome, if you ask me. Come on, what was the main news this week? Well, yeah, it's only mostly is the children. The children are number one because if you kill children, you don't have to worry; they're going to grow up. The women are also dangerous because they give the children. Okay, so nothing much about 122 killed. They keep it silent. Like you would not fucking believe this. So, ladies and gentlemen, I want to know how much the results are going to change once I enter to Al Jazeera and acknowledge that I read that news and do the same thing. It transferred me to automatically, I did not even touch anything. So what it says right there at the top is Gaza killed 14. And it would not even open me the page, okay? Interesting. I really did not click that. I'm going to click again on that link, kill 122. And again, it throws me out so that I don't get to see it. But uh, luckily for me, there is a link down below. I saw also from the Al Jazeera where they report also 122 killed. Because I want to know what's going on with this 122. 14 is a lot, but 122, you have to admit, that is a whole, a whole, a whole, a lot more. What's happening with this, folks? Look at that. I'm not clicking anything. I'm not doing anything. I am not going to get any results here, I assume. There will be no results about this stuff here. So I'm going to give up on this, even to have ability to access the news, and I'm going to go ahead and copy this Google News, and we'll Google this. Now, at Google, definitely they did the knowledge that I'm searching for the certain news, definitely I'm searching for the certain news that is associated with 120 deaths. There's no fucking way. Still, I cannot get anything about 122 like a headline other than from Al Jazeera. This is actually quite amazing to me. Okay, let's do it like this. Uh, something is there on Twitter, <clears throat> now known as X. There is another news agency that reports here 122, and on Instagram they say 122, and injured 56. 
this is a fucking horror. I mean, I can imagine, but really not, don't want to imagine the war where you don't actually exist till they actually wipe you out and then you don't exist at all. But this is the nature of the international Jew today. This is the type of warfare greater than Great Britain, United States of America, Germany, and other freedom-oriented countries are running. This is the way it goes. And it's identical with my case. It's the same thing. You're doing exactly what I stated to you right now. It's identical. It's totally, totally identical stuff. So, folks, we don't have to worry about anything. This is from the, during the past week. Look at that. And there is no information, anything. That's a bit fucked up. You got to admit, this is really, really fucked up. And when you click the Al Jazeera link, you don't even get there. Oh, it says here, Operation Alsa Flood, day under 100 bodies recovered at Al Shifa Hospital. We're going to get to that link. This is a fucking information horror, if you ask me. Nowhere anything from Guardian, nowhere anything from BBC, nowhere anything from CNN, nowhere anything from what is this Sky News you have? Okay, I wouldn't think about these real times. You know, when the Israelis are releasing the higher numbers of casualties than what Western media. You know their Western media is then so complacent in an extermination procedure, in genocide, that it could not be more. You know that when Jews are releasing the numbers that they fear in advantage to Palestinian people greatly from even Western media, you know that something is terribly wrong. This is also was the U issue Mainstream media and Israelis have used during MK Ultra to suggest me, you know, we are more objective, even that is our country, than the Western media and so on. Fuck not. So, really, what's happening today when it comes to the news? Um, the news, you know, that really, really matters, and it's what's purchased by the U.S. government by simply paying for the student debts, actually forgiving the student debt. Today, what actually matters, like a main news that you should pay attention to, and that's actually, let me see that again. Oh, the Hamas doesn't have 40 refugees. Too bad, man. You know what? They, they want to have soon people enough they want they want to have 40 palestinian people left soon the way things are going and then they won't have to worry about anything anyways i get it it's like on a humorous side right today ladies and gentlemen the main news it looks totally dramatic to me and i do want to multiply one i hope they have they have something with the postal office in Britain that was also involved in MK Ultra. That this is just so retarded that I would not even, you know, they troll and troll and troll. So I wouldn't even pay attention to it. The main news today, ladies and gentlemen, is this one here I'm going to outline to you. Actually, I already have it here. I was going to paste this, but since I'm going to post this picture next to some other stuff right there, the main news today, if I outline you, is your American president who 
covered the internet with his next to his cafe, next to his cafes. He also get yeah, that. I mean, he's right there. It's like a black tunnel right behind him. Um, what is it? Light at the end of the tunnel, or is it is Biden in front of this tunnel? Um, and he will actually do something and that's going to change your world for much, much, much better. Okay. He will release Julian Assange and don't worry about those 122 corpses. Central Intelligence Agency, provocateur, agentur, just as I insisted all along, Julian Assange. I don't give a three fuck about United Nations, what United Nations got to say. United, say, United Nations repeats wherever the fuck they're told. Goofy fuck will repeat whatever they are told to repeat. Should I not fucking worry about people that do like a dog, like a, like a goofs basically acting over there in some building in the midst of the stuff that goes on today, completely indifferent from what Adolf Hitler used to do 80 years ago. So don't worry about it. You're going to get your big hero back. It's going to be Julian Assange, and it's your American president, the greatest man ever. His name is Joe Biden. And he will assure, according to American democracy, to your freedoms and liberties, that your Julian Assange now will come back to you. Because this is what fuck matters. I think I'll actually copy and paste. This, God forbid, you will fucking enter this. You don't fucking see anything. <laughs> you don't see anything. Look what this is. Look what the fuck is this? 14 is being killed. This is what they say. This shit is actually worse than what I previously suggested for my video that was done to me in respect to my fishing license. Video which I posted online here. It's worse. Because it seems like it did not even trigger artificial intelligence algorithm issues enough so that it would stimulate links, internet, through internet service provider to pop me up the stuff that I know is actually out there and are deliberately hiding from, omitting from getting to public to attention. They kill on a, such a grand scale that we can say they actually are engaging now in a blockage of the internet, of the resource, of the source, of the new source in respect to Gaza. And that's pretty bad. They're really, really in a hurry. And, well, they, they killed I don't know how many people within the last few days. It's going to get worse now. Prepare yourself. Fasten your belt. Uh... Look, number killed. I guarantee you that you're going to see about number 40,000 within probably next 14 days or something like that. It's going to be a, like a super, super, super duper massacre that will go on through a Palestine. Because it was programmed that way that Jews military is going to move out to the certain parts of Palestine What's going to make Palestinian people relax, think opposite than what Joe Biden coordinated together with Israeli parliament, therefore with the Israeli Knesset. And that would actually attribute to more casualties, more 
uh, desirable military outcome. Joe Biden did not interfere in the state of the Israeli massacre on Gaza for the sake of the Gaza and Palestinian people, but actually to fool, according to MKUltra, Palestinian Gazan people, so there would be more casualties, more death that would arise. Thanks for watching this video. Really important news now to get date and time. We're going to do it like this. Yeah, enjoy your internet. It's free. It's better than if you go to McDonald's or Burger King. There you have to pay for uh, two and you get the third one for free, right? Here you get everything for free. It's internet. It's, it's a free world. Everything is free.